And I'm pushing this turret. Well, I tried to, anyway. <laughs> it wasn't for Kennen's lightning ball thing. And him killing all my minions. Riven's coming up top now. Getting stunned by her. Getting a lot of damage taken by Riven. And so is Cannon. They're all up top now. They really want to kill me. But with my body, with my uh, with my E, my body slam, which makes me maybe to charge away and my f and flash, I'm basically pretty much ungankable. If I do that right, obviously. And with my ultimate, I'm pretty much ungankable anyway. His ultimate is uh, Gragas throws his cast to an area upon landing. It deals 200 plus 81 magic damage to all units struck, knocking them back. So it's very good if you're against if you're on a turret, you can knock them into your turret. Or you can duck them away. Uh, uh, you can use it defensively to m knock them away, or you can use it offensively, offensively, to uh, knock them into your turret. And it's very good to uh, in another offensive way. If, for example, if I was chasing someone here, I could um, knock him into the wall because it, uh, it stuns him for a little, uh, like a, a short second. I think it's a second or half a second. If they if they are hit, it doesn't really say. But I think they're stunned for the um, until the knockback effect lasts. How long the knockback effect lasts? Which I think is like a second or half a second. The killing has disappeared. He is flipping ninja, so he, I think he can just do that. I'm not sure. Like hang on. when he comes back, oh, we'll see if he's flipping ninja or not. Because I swear, anyone who is flipping ninja in this game just is able to just, just disappear for a short while and just come back. Randomly, I mean, he was right here. Yeah, ninja. This unit is flipping ninja. He used to stun off me, but since I used my body slam when he's using his ollie, I was able to use my body slam out of his ollie. It wasn't really, he uh, couldn't really get me now. now. I'm really packing a punch with my uh, with my Q, with my barrel roll now. Since I got my blast on one. Malzahar picking the kill on Cassidy. Gang playing can uh, gang and Malzahar really pushing his tyrant now. Kassan's not that Kassan's dead and Riven's missing. And I'm really low on health, so I'm using my ult to get him away. I'm just, still using my barrel to poke him down. Can I get it? I use my I use my body slam, but don't get the ignite off, no! So close! You midget ninja! Gah! I'm like trying to go for the kill on Cannon, but he gets away on like no health. <laughs> da, that luck. Da. So what's the farm now? I'm got 58, 59, 44 to 47, 52 to 28. Cassidy's really slacking on the on the farm. Cannon, since he's been up on the top lane this entire game, he's he's uh, kept his farm up quite well, and Riven's picking up the pace now. Mine's quite well. I'm not sure what is good farm or is bad farm for threes, but it's better than theirs, so we'll, we'll say it is. <laughs> Kassadin's back bottom. He's not giving this lane up at all. And Robin's back into the field. She, she did disappear when uh, Kennen was able to be uh, luck out twice. Use my body time to get away. Can you, oh, just nearly, just gets away from his uh, lightning ball. I do get stunned, but nothing really major. He's a little weakling, flipping ninja. God damn you! Malzahar is coming up to the top lane now. This cannon's really grinding my gears, being able to get away like this. I think it's time to put him out of his misery. He wants to die, I know he does. Just look in his little eyes. Now they have Dragon, Crest of the Crushing Wrath. Didn't know it was actually in threes, but it obviously is. It increases the damage. You can't really see, because they're at the turret. I think they're scared of the minions. Obviously, what, why would you be scared of Gragas for? Just look at him, he's so cuddly. Who knew you want to give him a, a cuddle? Gangplank gets the um, the turret there. Kenning's gone down bottom trying to kill the Gangplank. But because of the all of the programming of LOL Replay, you may not see his health. I'm not really slagging off LOL Replay. I'm able to get the kill on Riven there. There's so much stuff going on, I can't... 
<laughs> I can't commentate on all of it. And now it looks like, oh, Kit Kassin snipes Gangplank there. I'm flashing, use my Olimut. Slap, slap Kassin right in the back there. Avenging Gangplank's death. Two turrets, and two, two kill, two turrets, two kills. It's a pretty good trade for a kill on Gangplank. I think that's a pretty good trade. Us getting two turrets and two kills, and them getting a kill. I think it's a pretty good trade. I think. Now I'm really going to punch now on yes on these minions. I'm able to clear out these minions really really fast now with my uh, with my barrel roll and my body slam. My, my barrel is on max now, so I'm, I'm stacking on up on uh, my body slam and just getting a couple on uh, my drunken rage. I think I I, um, I get my drunken rage maxed first. Yeah, I think I do. And then we go for dragon, but dragon's gone. They still have Dragon, they still have the Dragon, Kellen still has the Dragon buff, he's been able to get away because he's such flippin' ninja. And here comes Riven. She, she went in and charged out, which kind of messed up my E, my, uh, my, my body slam there. He's my ultimate, trying to get him away, but Cassidy's Force Pulse just is too slow. Cassidy's Force, too slow, sorry. <laughs> Cassidy's force pulse just uh, slows me too much. Gangplank trying to get a kill. He doesn't fear death. In his dying wish, just does his ultimate. Pure bravery right there. And Kenan, because he's got that Rylas Crystal Scepter now, just able to turret die with his. They're all about to turret dive and get killed, Mazaha. Ryan nearly dying from the turret there. Cassin pulling away. Cannon and Riven still, still, still at the turret. Do you realise I'm still alive now? I'm alive now, actually. I'm waiting in there. I come out of the bush. They seem to have gone. They've gone. It was smarter than to do that. So I'm now five to three and one. So I'm doing pretty well. Getting a bunch of kills. My farm is doing quite well. I now have my Rabadons. So I've got 238 ability power. That's quite a lot. I remember, so I'm, I'm going to be doing a lot of damage. We still have Gangplank and Malzahar bottom. Cassin's pushing his turret again. So um, he, he wants his turret down. And I, don't, I don't think he does. I think he does though. I don't know. Now I'm coming down. Wayne in this bush. Because as you can see, I'm just such a stealthy assassin, obviously. Cassidy made his way up top. He must have shifted round where I was. Shifted round before I was able to see him. And Kenan was top lane, but now he's missing. Since he's a flippin' ninja, he can able just to, 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 just to jump lanes with ease. Cassidy just used his ultimate. They just jump onto Gangplank right there. All three of them. Mazahar using his ultimate on Riven. I'm able to get the kill on uh, Riven as well. And I pick up the triple kill. It is delicious. It is absolutely delicious. Take a quick swig. And on we continue. Red buff now. Hitting quite a lot with his 163 attack damage. That was a hit turrets and a hit of his quite a lot. Cass and Arrival respawned now. They are angry. They did not want that turret down. I just miss. Oh no, it comes Ken, Ken, Ken with the ultimate now. I just missed the kill on Kassan, and I think I hit my um, my key on the inhibitor there. We're running for our lives. I use my ultimate to knock him back. I think it doesn't. I think it does work. I'm able to get away. Since I flash my and uh, enough mana for my body slam, so I can easily get away. I uh, use my dragon ray to restore a lot of mana, so, and I take a lot a lot less damage. Rob has not done a, barely any damage. Like I said, she's spamming her Q, which uh, 
is doing like no damage to Malzaha, even though he was on low health. So yeah. And now I have the Dragon Buff. The unit deals 14% increased damage, and I have Red Buff. So that's a good. And now I think I go back and uh, do I get? Yes, I go for my Crystal Scepter now. I remember. So I pick up a Blast and one and an Amplified Totem. So I've got over 300 ability power. So I'm getting, oh, I'm pretty strong now. Gangplank with the Infinity's Edge. Getting up a lot of crit. It's basically what you want with Gangplank. Gangplank chasing up onto, uh, onto Kassin now. He's put over his horse now. The chase is on. Kassin uses all of it trying to get away. Using the Force Ball to slow him. But Gangplank uses his Ollie to slow him. And gets the kill. Very nicely done. Not sure how you can uh, get open these bars, but whatever. Always uses a mime when riding in that, but no for fear. And here comes Cannon, stun, uh, get, uh, uh, getting a couple of stuns onto uh, Gangplank there. My, my, my mime went blank, that, cause that kill was just so epic by me. Just, oh. My mind went blank for the due to the epicness it was. But anyway, Gampan picking a fight onto uh, Riven there, and I let him get the kill, because I think I've had enough. I've had enough kills now. 9 to 3. I think Gangplank deserves one kill. 3 to 6, you know, it's not bad. And I'm, I'm now on 91. I don't think farm really matters anymore due to the fact we are on their base. I think I did pretty well. I don't usually do this well with uh, Gragas. I used to play him quite a lot in farm.